Robinson off right tackle. And he is met and driven back. That is Arkansas defense. This running back they're facing have to be very good tacklers in the open field. Tackled for a loss. And how about the spirit of this Arkansas defense? Man, they have been... Three-man rush, dropping eight. Card looking for something. Now he's going to tuck, and he's going to be taken down, and Texas is going to be put. Dijon Robinson, good run and spitting. Leg, leg drop. Pretty good career. A whole bunch of guys there. Attacking the ball. Robinson is pushed back. Grant Morgan was the first to get there. Flying to the football, dominating the line of scrimmage. Off the times. Catches for 113 yards last week. Third and four. Pressure up the middle, and Carr goes down, and it's great. In a very light box, not a lot of defenders in the box. Yeah, watch right here. He's going to fake out and then come back in, and that's exactly how he beats him. Beats him inside. Look at him just swim right around. Gets the guard confused. The guard stays left. Bijan stays it's Just all about finding those advantages, and that's something he'll learn as he continues to grow within this offense. Texas has five total yards to this point. Hudson Card, redshirt freshman, out of the pocket, being chased, extending the play, and then shot down. Second and nine. Card. Off platform throw, and he gets it complete, and he does so quarter and that's the first first down for the horns Whittington in motion as Robinson gets the call finds a crease and somehow gets to the outside and just like that Bijan Robinson and look at the right side of that offensive line just collapse it and an excellent job by Bijan Robinson being patient pressing the hole and then getting back at, to the outside and now Card, look at the time he has Looking for anything and anybody, and then just hits the feet. Second and five. Empty set for Card. Looks right, and then is gobbled up. And that's so disappointing if you're the Texas Longhorns. This is a three-man rush against five offensive linemen. Three defenders, five blockers, and still results in a sack. That Williams coming off the edge again. Card getting free. Look at this toss to the end zone. Robinson. Texas only has 51 total yards. Arkansas 158. Bijan spinning after the initial contact. Had 24 touches last week for 176 yards from scrimmage. And he'll get it again. And he's tackled in the... Hard. Trying to extend and right at the line of scrimmage. And remember, Cameron Dicker, the longtime kicker and kickoff specialist, was asked this summer something to give him a little bit of confidence and get him feeling good about the plan. Kid was a wide receiver in high school up until a highly recruited quarterback moved on. He can motor if he needs to. Robinson again met with contact and then been in close, but man, they got to find some room in the run game. Card quickly to the outside, and that is Davis. Juan Davis is a fun third down. 0 and 4. Watch the pressure from Arkansas. It's a pressure look right now with some of those safeties creeping up. Keep an eye on Catalan. He might trigger a blitz. Catalan's one of the best defensive backs in all of college football. Had two interceptions last week. Play clock running down. Third and eight. Card. Has time. That's a wobbler. It was deflected at the... Because he sat out the first half because of targeting. That's scary for Texas. Got to get something going. Robinson trying to be that somebody to get something going. Great one here at Arkansas. Second and four. Hudson Card. Avoids the pressure and then checks down underneath to Johnson. 
And Roshan Johnson will move the chain. They're breathing fire on the front. It's his first season as a left tackle. Robinson, not much there at all again. Second and nine. Hard. Downfield, wide open, and it is incomplete. And then coming in, trying to make a play on it. What a difference a week makes. You see that comparison hard last week to this week. Third and 14, three man rush. That gives Card time, but he goes underneath and hustling to the ball. They meet up with Whittington. To be able to hold up against these Razorback defensive linemen. Dijon Robinson is going to try to get this second half started. Katie. Well, guys, one thing we know about Sark. Second and seven. They go with an inside screen. I mean, this Arkansas front left. And then obviously rallying quickly and beating the lineman to the spot. Drop the wide receiver for a minimal game. Third and eight. Yet to convert a third down tonight. Hudson Card goes underneath short of the line to make to. They've only been in Arkansas territory once before this. Have to take advantage. Bijan Robinson. As he gets it. BJ, what a play. One hander, tap to himself, interception. Robinson now, first down, Horn. Johnson gets the call. And Johnson muscles ahead. Second seven. Card being chased. Card spinning and then wrapped up at the 10 yard line. It'll be third down, down tonight. Third and five out of the backfield and reaching Mation on first and goal. Robinson straight ahead. And finally, Texas is on the board. And that's the guy who. How good is the SEC at night? Card, play action, setting up. Downfield, open is worthy. And it was to the right. Second and ten. Time again, deep again, and incomplete again. Joshua Moore was the. Beaver's got a step. It's a perfectly blocked play. And he throws it, but look at where it ends up. It's way right of the wide receiver. He's got. Third and ten. Card on the run, and that's a nice act. Receiver, good job stepping up in the pocket. Had plenty of time. Only a three-man rush, finding the wall. First down, Texas. Dijon Robinson, patient, and then finds just enough of a crease to make his way to the front. play action when that safety creeps up. And here is the play action, but Card's got to extend the play. That was right on the hands of Whittington. Defense with Barry Odom. They have been top notch tonight. And can they get a stop here, or does Hudson Card have the answer on third and four? He's got time. He's going to tuck, run, and come up a yard short. 43, fourth and one. Texas is going for it. Robinson, not even close. He was. Wow. These two guys unblocked, eyes in the backfield, and they make the play right here. Nothing they can do. Man, you look at Henry comes in, the crown of the helmet. The crown of the helmet is what. Who do you like just behind Clemson? A lot of people said NC State, but here's Mississippi State up big in the second half. That ball is knocked out of the hand of Card, and that is being played as a whole game against Colorado, and he will come out to play quarterback. He was teammates. Sark gave him a fair chance, said it would come down to who takes care of the ball better. That was Hudson Card, and he gives him a little more upside. But right now, Thompson comes in the game with this 
big. He can really, really throw the football. Very accurate, perfect for this situation. Thompson now. This is what he can do on the ground. Now he did this last week as well. Checks down to Robinson. Robinson makes the most of it and then is ridden out of bounds. Thompson. He will tuck, wiggle, and then be taken down by Bumper Pool. All the way in when it comes to helping out this team. Dijon Robinson, that will be a first down for Texas. Thompson, plenty of time to take a shot. And way beyond 33 to 7. Number 15 has been punched right in the face tonight. And it's this defense that has been doing their job. Number Casey Thompson, the quarterback for Texas now. Third down and nine. Incomplete. He was looking for Cade Brewer. Flag is. Casey Thompson, who patiently waited his turn behind Sam Ellinger and now playing behind Hudson Card. And he's in the game trying to rally the horns as he runs ahead. Second and short. Robinson, it'll be first and goal, Texas. Casey Thompson drive. Texas trying to spark. Any sense of hope here. And Thompson helps do that. Casey Thompson comes into the game and scores on the ground. Let's take a look for tonight's AT&T 5G Sky Cam. You're going to see Casey Thompson just have an opportunity to catch that seam. Pretty good job also setting up the defender Fouché. Losing effort, man. The Pac-12's had a really good start to the year so far. This is Robinson, Keelan Robinson, with the run for Texas. Chip game undefeated to have a signature big championship game win. They need Penn State to be good. Correct. Right? They need Michigan to be good. Yes. They also need all the teams in the ACC to stay where they're at. Because if Clemson's schedule strengthens, then Clemson could be in a position to jump them as well. Thompson wobbly. A lot of people think about maybe Texas A&M being a big speed bump for Alabama. A&M struggled on the road today playing Colorado in Denver. Here is Whittington on a crossing route and he will have it for a first down. After only two attempts in Haynes King in goes Zach Calzada and he looked shaky. The offense just didn't operate with any levels of efficiency. Now if Haynes King is for whatever reason sidelined for an extended period of time Calzada's good thrower but he's got a long way to go after what he showed us today. Casey Thompson can run the ball he goes for nine yards there. Robinson on second and one, and he can't make it back to the line of scrimmage. A loss with that last tackle. Thompson, look at the time he's got on third and two, and he gets it complete as he connects to the 30, trying to just chip into this the head coach in Austin. Casey Thompson going to glide towards the sticks. Because that mm -hmm. dude brings the heat on some of these hits, man. He has been flying around tonight here in the second half now that he's off of his targeting suspension. Robinson, good commitment to go ahead. We mentioned the fan. That's a big part of Sam Pittman's appeal, too. Got to keep the guys that grow up Razorbacks, keep them in state, keep them as Razorbacks. Can't leave the state. Thompson scanning, extending to the end zone. He goes too far out of bounds. Relationships that he's cultivated over the years. Thompson and to the goal line and in. A week ago. 
Five nine one eighty three Robinson's the running back here on first and goal. And he'll get the work. And he won't even be able to get back to the line of scrimmage. And a future conference rivalry. Robinson again and Robinson again is driven back. Bumper pool and the rest of them wrestling him down the line. Going to be amazing as conference foes. Third and goal. No, again. With under three minutes to play for a fourth and goal stop. Casey Thompson, sprint right, looking for anything, trying to turn the corner, and he reaches across and gets in on fourth and goal. Thompson's playing with some fire since he's come in. That was a great effort there. Deep, real deep. Arkansas thinks this of Texas. The past, the present, the future, all converging to celebrate a win over the team that they don't like so much. The Hogs walloped them here. Katie. Thank you, Taz. Coach Pittman.